Welcome back to CI Living on, Celebrates the Holidays here at City Center in Champaign. We've got a live audience, and uh, thank you for being around, too. We appreciate it. And you know, just like no party is complete without a fun holiday game, it's also not complete until you have some delicious holiday appetizers. And we know just the gals to help us out from Dish Passionate Cuisine, Colleen and her sister Elizabeth. We're glad you guys are hanging out with us today. Bring in the goods. Yes. Thanks. Now, um, per usual, you have a wide variety, and we've tried to put them all on the same plate so you can tell us uh, what you've made and uh, perhaps a little bit of the secret behind uh, how you've made them. How? Well, that's a tricky question, Tim. But You hold the microphone, I'll eat. Absolutely. So <laughs> we're going to start over here. We've got some antipasto skewers, which have some olives and artichoke hearts, salami, mozzarella, oh, and tomatoes. Ooh. Yummy. These are our buffalo chicken um, bites. Which is buffalo yeah. chicken, um, blue cheese dressing. Yeah, those are yeah, they're delicious. And they and then we fry them in some panko and eggs. We've got a bacon caramelized onion and Swiss cheese dip, which is quite tasty. Mm -hmm. These are our southwestern mini bell pepper poppers. Say that three times really fast. It's a little tricky. Is this supposed to be one bite? It's up to you. Good it's up to you. What's in it again? Don't buffalo chicken. Him. It's delicious. You'll be good. You'll be good. You got this. Then we've got some smoky chipotle meatballs, and Liz is going to take everybody <laughs> through the desserts. Uh, well, for desserts, Colleen, our, of course, made our chocolate mini cupcakes with our famous yummy frosting. We also have salted chocolate caramel tarts. You okay there? Okay. Uh, Are you sure? Colleen's new addition. Do you need to talk? Of the, I'm good, I'm good. Okay. Okay. the eggnog cookies, and then um, a fan favorite is the peppermint bouchons. What? And you can do that in one bite, too. Bouchons? The peppermint bouchon. If you're, you know. There's one? Yeah. Um, I don't have a microphone. Is, I thought bouchon was a dog. Mm -mm. I'm going to go that that's a bichon. This oh. is a bouchon. There is a very big difference, and bouchons are a French pastry that are very high in butter and low in flour. Are bichons at least a French dog? Yep. Okay. <laughs> One bite? One bite. Do it, Do more. it. Do it. What is the key that's to... very chocolatey. <laughs> <laughs> what is the key to the perfect holiday appetizer? In my personal opinion... Only, but my key is I think anything that you can do ahead of time oh. so that we can all spend time with the people that we love is the things that you can make ahead of time and just throw in the oven and pull out. Nobody wants to be in the kitchen. We talk about this all the time. You should never be in the kitchen when you're entertaining. You I want agree. things that you can make ahead of time. And Tim just wants Where's things he can me? continue to eat. Well, I'm curious, like, how many of these things are literally bite-sized and how many of them are meant to be consumed slowly? I'm getting so food far, on my mic. I'm like four for four. You are. On bite size. I think this might be five for five. I think you can do it. You've got this. What do you think? Yes? I think you're good. Just don't try to talk afterwards. Oh, my word. I am impressed. Uh -oh. I am, you're good. You've you got a few minutes. We can talk. Heather and I and Liz, we got this. Tim needs to try a shrimp starter like I did yesterday. I heard. I heard. It was good times. You know, the other thing you might want to think about is doing is, like, have you ever seen Duff Goldman eat a cupcake? What? Like, he pulls the bottom off and flips it on top and makes a sandwich. That might have been a better plan for you. Mm. That's a salted chocolate caramel tart. Mm. That wasn't one bite. I learned my lesson. <laughs> I'm not doing that again on TV. Fair enough. Fair Ooh, enough. so good. Thanks. What was I going to Those are the mm. Southwestern... Um, mini bell pepper poppers so they're very they're not spicy at oh, all they're good i had one they're not spicy at all they've just Did got like cream cheese no. cumin a little bit of um chili powder black beans corn and they're stuffed into the mini bell peppers Can I see those like you know how when you start eating and you think i'm really hungry and then you eat fast and you realize had you eaten a little slower you would have stopped a while ago i think i'm at that spot Well, at least you get effort for trying. There's no doubt about that. Oh, really good. Well, thanks. I do appreciate that. My staff, my chefs are amazing. They I am are. very, very lucky. I have an amazing staff. Okay, that powdered cookie was so good. Those are ooey gooey eggnog cookies. They're a new oh. thing that I did this year. Spot on. Thanks.
Okay. We love when you come. Thank you so much Thank for helping you. us out. I don't suppose we have any drinks, do we? I'll get you some. I'll get you a glass of water. Thank you. No. Let's visit with some crowd members to see how well they like the treats. We got some friends behind us. Y'all want to ch chat? Come here. Stand up here on what, your chair. What have you eaten so far? Stand up here. Uh, meatballs. Did you eat them um, like all in one bite or did you cut them up a little? Um, I eat them. He eats them, Tim. All at once. Come My on. man, I like What's it. What's your name? Saria. And have you been good this year? Real good? What's on your list for Santa? Um, PJ Masks. PJ, is that cool? Okay, I hope you get it. I hope you've been really, really good. I think this means we may be out of touch with That's what the kids right. are wanting these days. Oh, 